Hi guys, it's Elliot from TutorialEdge.com and welcome to the first tutorial in the LibGDX tutorial series. In this tutorial we're going to be covering downloading LibGDX and creating a project and then importing it into the Eclipse IDE using a Gradle extension. So to get started we're going to want to go to LibGDX.BadLogicGames.com and click on the download link at the top. And then where it says download setup app, download that. And find out where you've saved it to. So I've already downloaded it so I'm going to just click discard. I'm going to navigate to where I've saved it which is just here and it should open up this um, window here. So just to get started we're going to call this tutorial libgdx and we're going to want to navigate to our Android SDK and where did I save it? Um, so mine saved it e e colon backslash sdk. Um, but you'll have to download this on your local machine and find the path. And once you've got the, that path, just paste it in here. And same goes up here. Um, so I'm going to configure where I want to save it. So got one. So. I am going to put it in the libgdx folder and I'm going to call this libgdx.01 okay open that and then once that's all done and configured make sure all these sub projects are ticked and click generate and you get loads of annoying me pop-ups yes and you should see it starting to work down at the console bit below. So while that's getting up and running we're going to go over to the Eclipse IDE and close all this and in order for us to install a, a Gradle project we're going to have to extend the Eclipse IDE to um, integrate with Gradle so to do that you can go to help and Eclipse Marketplace and once you've done that, go up to the search bar at the top here and type in Gradle and then click the Find button. And that should um, come up with the following options. And it's the second one that you're going to want to install. And once you've done that, um, you'll then be able to import all the, the LibGDX um, projects that you want into Eclipse. So I've already done it, but I'm just going to click Cancel. And then if we come back to this, um, you should see at the bottom, build successful, total time, 12 seconds, done. And it gives you instructions as to how you can import it once you've installed the Gradle plugin. So I'm going to come up to File and Import. And select Gradle, Gradle Project. Click Next. And then we're going to want to browse to where you op saved your game. So I saved it in LibGDX Tut1. Click OK. And... Build model, and then select this wee bar here so they're all um, selected, and then you can click finish. And that'll automatically import everything we want into the Eclipse IDE. Okay, so just to make that check if that worked, um, we're going to go to the desktop one, source. And we're going to click Run As Java Application. And if everything's been successful up to this point, you should see a red screen with the Bad Logic Games logo in the bottom left-hand corner. So that's you successfully created your first LibGDX project and imported it into the Eclipse IDE. So if you found this tutorial useful at all, then please leave the video a like and. If you want more LibGDX tutorials, then subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.